If a retirement account is payable to an estate or to a trust, different things happen. IRAs should never be paid to an estate, and frankly, with the new rules that have just come out, 401ks probably should never be paid to an estate either. An estate means your will. And the IRS, in their wisdom, which frankly this is not too wise, has said that if an IRA is payable to an estate, then the money has to come out of that IRA fairly rapidly, certainly within five years, maybe even a shorter period of time if the person whose IRA it was was old. If, however, it's payable to a trust, and if, and this is a huge if, and if the trust is relatively recent and was done by a highly qualified lawyer, then what can happen is, is the IRA money can come in, the 401k money may be able to come in, and the beneficiaries of the trust can take the distributions out over a very long period of time, over their remaining life expectancy. So if I leave my IRA to my 20-year-old son, and my 20-year-old son has a life expectancy of, let's say, 65 years, then he can take those distributions out over a long period of time, over 65 years. This year he can take 165th, next year 164th. If, however, I named my estate, he'd have to take all the money out in five years. Not a good thing because it's all subject to tax when you take it out.